it on that side. <laughs> hey, you want me to put it on the other side? Wow! Oh, <laughs> quick, quick, take it off before Dennis gets yeah. here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey guys, what's up? Hey, hey, you brought the costume, right? Right here. Well, what? Why aren't you in costume? I am. I'm Louis Ruckheiser, the host of Wall Street Week. <laughs> Here he comes, here he comes. Oh, well, well, somebody stole it. You're right yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, I'm looking for a very dear friend of mine. Have any of you seen Saddam Hussein? <laughs> very nice, guys. Very, very impressive. Uh, hey, Darlene, it's getting pretty late. Don't you think you ought to put on your costume? <laughs> I kid, I'm a kidder. I kid. Oh, oh, God. God. God, I love this holiday. You get free candy, and you get to humiliate your friends, and it's legal. Obviously. You're the guy that broke into the cooking classroom, aren't you? Uh-huh. What are you babbling about, Darlene? Well, we went in there this morning to finish our home ec projects, and there were a few things missing. Oh, like some knives and the meat cleaver. Mm -hmm. A cleaver? Mm-hmm. As if you didn't know. <laughs> I didn't take it, Darlene. Why would I? It has no style, no wit. However, if you're looking for a fork, I'm the man to ask. <laughs> He'll get his tonight. <laughs> Engin. Oh, Zach. Uh, hey, you look really scary. I'm not wearing a costume, Engin. I'm just scary. All right. Bet you thought you were pretty slick. Sneaking out on me yesterday, huh? Well, now you owe me two bucks for yesterday, two bucks for today, plus another six fifty because uh, I didn't like your movie. Well, I, I don't have it all on me right now. I think I'm gonna see for myself. No, Zach, they take. Oh, oh God, Zach, uh, it's not what you think. Oh, uh, it's, it's okay. You you don't have to explain. Please don't tell anyone. Sure. Hey, you know you know I I, I, I was just goofing with you, Angan. Okay? I mean... We, we, we cool? I, uh... I guess I can let it go. <laughs> this time... All right, thanks, Arvid. And look, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not gonna mess with you anymore. I promise. Uh, that's Mr. Engen to you. Mr. Engen. Very good. Now scram. Unless you're feeling lucky. Are you? Punk? <laughs> Who am I? I'm Batman. <laughs> oh, there you are. Where were you when I was mugged the other day? <laughs> cute, cute. Yo, Bill. I owe it to you too, Arvid. How you doing? Good. Damn good. Where's your costume, big guy? Oh, I got it in my bag. I was kind of embarrassed about wearing it in the streets of New York, you know? People might think I was nuts. They might run away in terror the minute they clap ties on me. <laughs> me think, hey, brilliant! I should wear it all the time, maybe every day. Well, well you're, you're not really afraid, are you? It's dangerous out there, Arvid, I tell you. I mean, you're the one who told me to live one day as a lion rather than a whole lifetime as a lamb. Well, that's how I'm living it, as a lion. Of course, today I'm a bat, but uh, on other days I'll be much more lionish. Great! Oh, Billy! Oh, you look splendid! A fine rabbit! Listen, would you help me blow up these balloons? The kids have to have the gym decorated by six. Oh, how tempting. Alone with you in a fairy suit in a room full of rubber novelties. Whoa. <laughs> That's right. Sorry, I can't. It's too late, and I'm going to have to grab a cab before... Before it gets dark? That's not what I was about to say. I was going to say before the news comes on, actually. <laughs> Are you implying something? Okay, I admit I've been a bit more cautious than usual, but that doesn't mean I've been running home like a scared... Rabbit? <laughs> Billy, you know, you have a right to be afraid. I admit it. I'm afraid. Mr. McGregor? <laughs>
I need your first quarter uh, attendance figures for the Board of Education meeting. If I don't have them, I look like an idiot. I'll see if I can find them. Don't think it'll help, though. <laughs> People, that's a sick, disgusting thing to do. Aren't there enough horrible things in the world without you inventing more? Come on, everyone. Let's just calm down and go back to the carnival, okay? Yeah. Here's Dennis! Dennis! <laughs> that was priceless. I'm sorry, but... You guys set up that phony madman story so beautifully, I couldn't resist. Oh, you want to see a madman? <laughs> that man struck me with a carrot. Maybe he thought you were Elmer Fudd. <laughs>